This is a quick training video for the uh, Pop Notify uh, plugin on WordPress. Uh, once you install the um, plugin, um, you're going to get this um, uh, menu item, and if you click on that, um, you can see that we've gone into the um, Pop Notify um, add-in screen. Okay, so up here we can see that we can um, add new. This could what this does is it allows you to add a new um, ad into your rotation. And then we have our ads list here, and then we have like the setting tabs here. Um, so what we can do is um, we can disable the plugin completely. Um, we can display in the home page, in all pages, all posts. Um, if we actually just want to display a specific post, we wouldn't do that. We would just go to posts. Um, go into our post and you can see like we've got the pop notify add section so we can just check that and then just display in the specific post okay so going back so what I'm going to do is I'm going to say display in home page and all pages you can do a rotation speed <coughs> that's um, how long the ad will show for before the next um, ad will show. So we can say something like eight seconds. Delay time is how long it takes from when the user visits your screen to the um, ad actually showing. So I'm actually put that as um, yeah, only that's two seconds. The number of rotations is how many times it will cycle through um, your ads. Um, put for zero if you want it to. Um, go on infinitely until they close it or click it. Um, time to display. This is um, how many times the, the, the ad will actually be shown to a particular visitor. Um, so if they visit your site five times and this is set to um, four, on the fifth time they won't see um, the ad. Um, and then the max number of ads on screen, um, it will, this will, when you mouse over the ad, the other ad can slide on top. I'll show you this. Um, but you can specify how many ads can stack or, or, or in one time on the screen. Um, it'll, be, it'll be a little bit clearer once I actually show you. And if you've got, like, say, two ads, it'll never show more than two. It will never show more than the ads that you have in the rotation. So I'm going to save this. That's now saved. Um, now let's go back and add an ad. So the first one I'm going to add. Okay, so I'll put some text in. Um, the point back to Google. And we leave this as running. You can set this up as paused or running. I'm not going to put an image in. And I'm going to save that. You can see the record's been saved, record added. Um, I'm actually going to add another one. I'm going to select an image. So I'm going to select this image here. I'm going to put in a destination. And I'm going to save the changes. So that record is added as well. So I'm going to click back on edits. You can see that we've got one of the picture here. You can see all the details. Um, so now if we go back to we go to the blog's main screen, we can see that the um, ads are popping up here. And I, I'm going to mouse over so you can see it actually stack. And you can see this one, we didn't actually um, put an uh, image in, so it's just a little icon in there. And as you see, it's stacked up because I did the mouse over. And if you want to close it, you just click the X, and it's gone. A um, couple of things. You can actually pause an ad just by clicking pause. And you can see that it's pause and the resumes come up here. Um, you can edit by clicking on the edit here and you know, change any of the details here or upload another image. Um, 
And you can also um, bolt delete. So you know we can select all of these, say delete, apply that. And if you want to delete these, yeah, just say yes, and they're all gone. So that's it. That's uh, pretty much how you use the um, plugin.